Welcome back to your third week of Tech Talk Sessions Online. So, with our football as always, we're going to start with our skills. Football's on the floor. Starting off, just rolling that ball from one foot to the sole to sole. Nice and easy, just like that. Excellent. And then again, we've got the technique right. Start to get on your toes, jumping from one foot to the other. Rolling that ball on your toes. Remember, go as fast as you want. Don't go too fast at the beginning. Don't want anyone falling over. Taking your time, just rolling that ball from one foot to the other. So whatever pace you can do, give it a try. Okay? Give it a practice and come back to us. Right, guys, moving on. So this time, one foot's going to roll it using the sole of our foot. The other one, using the inside to do a little kick. So we're going to roll it, kick it. Roll it, kick it. Roll it, kick it. And again, once we can, build up a little bit of speed. Let's see how fast you can get them. Okay. Now, once you've done some with one foot, so we'll say 20 with one. So that's 20 inside and 20 rolls, you're going to swap over. So my right foot did the roll. My left foot did the inside. So this time, left foot's going to do the roll. Right foot's going to do the inside. So I'm just swapping over the jobs, doing exactly the same. Roll it, kick it. Roll it, kick it, roll it, kick it, roll it, kick it. Just like that. Remember, 20 with each foot. That's it, well done, keep going. Twenty with each foot. And then come back to us. Give it a couple of tries. Off we go. Right, moving on. We're going to do some step over, X overs, take it away this time. So, step over, I start next to the ball and I'm opening my leg. Okay, X over, rewinding it, going back the opposite way, doing the same thing, back across the ball. Can I touch it and stop? And again, left foot, open, cross, touch, stop. Okay, and again, open, close, touch, stop. And again, I'll do one more for you. Open, close, touch, stop. So let's see if you can do 10 of them, counting them stops. So step over, X over, touch it, stop, that's one. Let's see if you can do 10. Moving on to our next skill, I want to see if you can try to do your Mario. So that's where we roll the ball back with the sole of our foot, using our laces to kick it back. Roll it back, kick it forward. Roll it back, kick it forward. Roll it, kick it. Okay? Just like that. Remember, going at your own pace. Just like that. Okay, now we're going to change that a little bit this week. I'm going to do two with one foot to the other but this week I'm going to go roll lace roll inside now the other one roll lace roll inside roll lace roll inside and again roll lace roll inside so that's your challenge give it a try give it have a good five minutes on practicing that just practicing getting it used to doing it with your laces and with the inside of your foot okay off you go guys now then, with our football, moving on again, we're going to practice doing some step over tap. So one foot goes round, other one taps the ball. So I'm going to do the same with one foot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Change to do the same with the opposite foot again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Just like that. Give it a try, guys. Ten with each foot. Let's see how fast we can do them. Right, so we should be familiar with this one from our challenge last week. Using the tip of our toes just to roll the ball forward a little bit every time. Moving around, just rolling it forward into space. Just like that. 30 to 40 seconds, try it. 
see how we get on and get back to us. Right, last one, just using one foot now at a time. I'm going to start with my right foot, my strongest one. Hopping on the spot or just still on the spot, I'm just going to go in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out. Just like that, loads and loads of little touches. Okay, do the same with the other foot, loads of little touches, in, out. Now, once you've had a few tries at these, you can start to go on your toes and start to hop as you do our kicks. Just like that. Moving my foot around the ball. Remember, always be in control of the ball. Okay, again with the other foot. Always in control. Moving your foot around it, moving it where you want it to go. So you can do 20 with one foot, 20 with the other foot. Give it a try. Okay guys, so our main skill this week is going to be our elastic. Okay, against our defender, this is a skill that we take the ball one way, put it back the other way and take it away from the defender. Okay, shifting in one side, making the space on the other to move into. So, shift that cone to the side, I'll show you first. So, I always start it with the inside, push it across my body and take it away with the outside. Okay, you can do this both ways, you can do it outside to inside or inside to outside. I'm going to show you the inside to outside this week. I feel it's a little bit easier to do. Okay, so just to push it away with the inside of our foot and then take it away with the outside. So pushing it across the cone, sending it towards my left, in, but taking it away towards my right, back onto my strong foot. So when I do that first touch with the inside, can we think what the defender's going to do? The defender is going to move to the space I've just played that ball to. So I'm playing the ball this way, the defender moves that way, but I quickly change direction and use the outside of my foot and move into that space that I've just created by sending my defender to the other side, okay? So again, dribbling up, in, out, just like that. Start off slow as always. Get the technique right first. There's no point in going 100 miles per hour, getting it wrong every time because it'll never work. Start slow, do the skill, build up your pace, and then start to go faster. So, in, out. And again, making sure I make two clear touches. They've got to be strong touches. In, out. Just like that. One more. In, out. Okay, now if you've got that really easy, if you've got the graphs of it, Try to do it with your weaker foot. So go left foot or right foot, whichever one's not your strongest one. Give it a try and come back to us. Off you go. Right, let's give that a try again. I've pressed stop recording then as I was talking. So three cones and your football and your big cone there to start with. You're going to throw your three cones that your mums and dads can do for you into a little bit of space, okay? One, two, Three, not too close to each other, try and get a little bit of distance in between. Can we see all three of them? We can. So, mums and dads are going to time you. You've got to try and get all three of them cones back to the starting marker here. You can only get one cone at a time, and you've always got to use them feet. I don't see anyone getting to the cone, picking their ball up, getting their cone and bringing it back. Only using them feet. Control it and stop it with your feet, okay? So start our timer ready. Three, two, one. Off I go. So I go into the first one. Home, take it back, put it down and go again. Next cone, stop, get that ball, and that cone, take it back, put it down, go again, one more. Pick it up, take it back to the beginning, and stop. Okay, really easy. As you can see there, when I got to my cones, instead of just stopping the ball and leaving it and turning around and moving myself around the ball, I did a turn. Okay, we've learnt these turns many, many weeks. We can roll it back, or we can use maybe a little cry turn to turn, take it back to the beginning again, okay? Right, guys, give it a try if you go. Well done today, boys and girls. That wraps up our session for this week. Really good work there, guys. Really, really impressed with some of our skills. Um, remember, start off slow, get the technique right, and we can start to go pace and go quicker and quicker every time so really again really really impressed with everyone's work keep them videos and pictures coming in i've got to say i'm really really impressed with the videos that i'm getting at the moment some great skills and just 
as always, most importantly, just have fun with what you're doing, enjoy it. That's the most important thing. As long as you're having fun and you're learning, it's, a, it's always a great start, okay? So, well done, guys. I will see you again next week for our next video. Bye, guys.